Scorpion is perhaps one of the most iconic characters from the Mortal Kombat lore. And why shouldn't he be? Everyone loves a murderous flaming demon, now don't they? Hello and welcome to our channel. Today, we're going to talk about the origins of Scorpion. So, let us begin. There are two rival clans in Mortal Kombat, the Shirai Ryu and the Lin Kuei. The Lin Kuei are basically superhuman fighters for hire who originated somewhere in Northern Asia. During the feudal era, a Japanese Lin Kuei warrior named Takeda, not the one from MKX, travels to Japan, transmits his ninjutsu skills to numerous generals and lords, and forms the Shirai Ryu, the first ever ninja clan. Takeda's betrayal of the Lin Kuei in order to form his own clan immediately puts the two clans at odds, and their animosity would grow through time, culminating on one tragic day thanks to the machinations of a specific netherrealm sorcerer named Quan Chi. Quan Chi wants to take a powerful amulet from the elder deity, Shinnok, but he needs a human to help him get past the amulet's defenses. As a result, he recruits a Lin Kuei warrior named Bi Han, codename Sub-Zero, as well as a Shirai Ryu named Hanzo Hasashi, codename Scorpion, in case Bi Han is unable to complete the task. Bi Han and Hanzo meet up on their journey, unaware that they were both recruited by the same man to do the same job. They find it out, Sub-Zero wins, and Hanzo is dead. Quan Chi massacres the whole Shirai Ryu clan, including Hanzo's wife and son, as payment for Bai Han delivering the map showing the location of the Shinnok's amulet. From this point forward, Hanzo Hisashi is no longer alive, and only the Spectre Scorpion remains. In the Nether Realm, Quan Chi manipulates Scorpion by informing him that it was Sub Zero who murdered his family and clan, and that in the next Mortal Kombat tournament, Scorpion manages to finally kill Sub Zero and avenge himself. However, some Zero returns in Mortal Kombat 2, and Scorpion follows behind, determined to eliminate his longtime foe. However, when watching one of Some Zero's fights in the tournament, he notices something that is quite unlike the Some Zero he knows. It's Mercy. Scorpion soon discovers that this Sub Zero was actually his brother Kuai Liang and not Bi Han. Scorpion pledges to defend this new Sub-Zero, whether it's out of sorrow for taking away his brother, a desire to atone for murdering out of vengeance, or something else, and it's this vow that pits him against Shao Kahn in Mortal Kombat 3, aligning him with the Earth Realm warriors. The target of Scorpion's anger varies significantly from game to game at this point. In Episode 4, it's back on Sub-Zero after being duped into believing he killed his wife and child. After learning the truth about his clan and his family's killings in Deadly Alliance, he's furious with Quan Chi. He becomes a champion of the Elder Gods in Deception, and he directs his hatred upon whoever the Elder Gods point him to. In Armageddon, he's furious with the Elder Gods for resurrecting the Shirai Ryu as Hellspawn fighters like himself. Then, with Mortal Kombat 9, the timeline is reset and everything goes back to normal. As a brainwashed servant of Quan Chi, Scorpion enters the Mortal Kombat tournament, murders Bi Han, and stays under his control until Raiden resurrects Scorpion's human form, Hanzo Hisashi. Kuai Liang invites Hanzo to the Lin Kuei Palace in Mortal Kombat 10 to finally bury the hatchet between them. Sam Zero explains that Kuan Chi was the one who slaughtered the Shirai Ryu and that he has no grudge against Hanzo for killing his brother. The two bow and become friends, their common hatred of Kuan Chi binding them together. As for Kuan Chi, he's finally apprehended by Earth's special forces, and Hanzo arrives on the scene ready to exact long-awaited vengeance on a fitting target. 
Unfortunately, he was too late to prevent Shinnok's resurrection, and he is beaten by the Elder God, but at least Kuan Chi died. So that's the story of Scorpion. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Do not forget to subscribe to our channel and do hit the bell icon on your way out. Till then, see ya.